The Tennessee Department of Transportation has a 10-year plan which includes the state's Choice Lane program. Cornelia Nicholson explains this and has more on the potential for Choice Lanes to be built here. TDOT's first ever 10 year plan highlights how they intend to invest $15 billion in Tennessee's infrastructure, including the potential for the first ever choice lanes. The $15 billion includes funds from the annual TDOT work program budget and the state general fund provided by the Transportation Modernization Act, also known as TMA, that was passed by the General Assembly earlier this year. Now, part of the money will go towards construction projects and statewide programs. Resurfacing bridge repair, uh, intelligent transportation projects, rockfall mitigation, those things that span the entire state. They've also set aside TMA funds to address highway congestion across the state with potential choice lanes. These new lanes allow drivers to pay a fee for a faster lane on the highway. TDOT says a potential choice lane in Chattanooga would be on I-24 near Moccasin Bend. You will see and hear about studies that are going on for all of these corridors currently. We are doing environmental work on each one of these corridors in anticipation of a choice lane project in the future. Choice lanes will be designed, built, financed, operated, and maintained through a public-private partnership with TDOT. Deputy Governor Butch Ely says it's still early in the process, so they don't know how much the fee will be, but says there will be a board to help establish a pricing method. There will be safeguards to ensure um, that um, what, what, whoever uh, is operating these roads will not be able to just to charge wherever they want to. TDOT says the I-24 corridor in Nashville is the first project they're working on. That, that's the first project that makes the most logical economic sense. That doesn't mean that we're prioritizing Nashville over the rest of the state. TDOT says they're still doing their homework and conducting studies here in Chattanooga, but you can find out more information about Choice Lanes over on our website. In studio, Cornelia Nicholson, Local 3 News.